Ready to master here. Got something cool off the Cornwall truck today and some other things to show you. But anyway, uh, picked up these. I actually ordered them a while ago and took them a while to get them in. Um, but uh, price was right, 50 bucks. Uh, Snap on wants about 200 for theirs, and it's just too much, too much to deal with. Um, for something I'm not going to use constantly, I figured this is a better buy. And uh, these are hose clamp pliers, ASHCP949. A Cornwall guy, he has pricing on all his stuff, which I like. Talks to you a little bit about what it does. Pliers can be locked, freeing up your hands and making your job easier and faster. U.S. patent. Re-engineered. Wider and deeper gears for secure locking. New cable adjuster and multiple gear lock provide accurate and secure locking for any clamp position between a minimum and a maximum range. On the back. Talks to you about the older style, the new style, blah, blah, blah. Pretty cool. Let's get these ponies open. Take a look at them. So here they are. Pretty nice units. Um, nice long reach on them. As you can see. And nice squeeze design. Ratcheting, or... Not really ratcheting, but it locks several positions. You can adjust the tension on it. And very nice design. Um, nice grips on them. Part number. ASH CP 494. Uh, CP. CP the tool addict. Hopefully you're watching this. I know you like your Cornwall tools. Hope you're having a good one. And uh, the end of them here. Looks like we got a nice mechanism. Looks pretty durable. Nice spring in there. Good technology. Coworker has these same ones. and He told me don't spend the 200 bucks on the Snap-on truck. Because they're made by Mayhew. I looked at them on Amazon. The Mayhew ones are around 60, I think, 65. I was going to get those, but Cornwall had these in the promo flyer, so I went with these. So anyway, that's the one item I got today on the tool truck. And it was on order for a long time because he said he's been having issues getting stock in for Cornwall, so... Uh, I hope Cornell's doing good. I like them. I hope they're hope everything works out for what's going on with them right now. So that's those. Let me get you some other things to show you. Some things I've had for a while that I really like. Never have really had any issues with. Stick those aside. So show you guys uh the old style handles. I have the master screwdriver set, the big one. This is the biggest size flathead that comes in it. I like these handles. I don't see anything wrong with them. And people think they're weird. They got four sides, but I've noticed that the old snap-on, the hard handle snap-on screwdrivers, they have four sides too. They just slim it down here in the neck, which I guess can be a little bit more comfortable. Um, but these work pretty good. You can get a lot of torque on them. I've never really had any issues with them. We use this one mainly as a pry bar. I've never used it on a flathead screw. Um, and I got some older picks here. I don't know if I've ever shown you guys. I uh, couldn't find any of the older style handled picks on the truck. They all have uh, the newer style handles like these. And uh, I have a set of those too. But they're the uh, soft spoon picks. But these I got on eBay for about 25 bucks, brand new. They were wrapped up and everything. And uh, these stay at home. I use them side jobs and stuff. You can see they're a little beat up, but um, they, they have a nice feel to them. You can get a lot of grip on these. So, 
highly recommend those. They're if you can find them still. I wanted blue, but blue always sells first because it's their main color. I wanted the blue screwdriver set too, but this is the last set of like the old style handles that he had in a big set. And I wanted the big set. So anyway, I also have some sockets here. Um, collected these over the years. I think my dad gave these to me. Old Cornwall USA sockets, all quarter drive. Um, this one's a 10 millimeter. So their metric has these little lines, several lines on the bottom. This one, I believe, is an SAE, so it doesn't have the extra lines. No, never mind. That's a 14. I don't know. Maybe it's just a different era. But this one is a half inch. Pretty basic, old. And this one is a uh, 3 8. And then these are pretty expensive. These are the USA, the good ones. And... Uh, I've seen the blue power set metric set on his truck, but it's like 279. <laughs> Goes to 15 millimeter, but this is just one individual 12 millimeter I somehow inherited. Uh, USA 12 point 12 mil quarter drive, really nice, good quality, man. Can't beat that USA Cornwall quality. And then just a generic pick with the Cornwall uh, quality tools logo on there got this off of his truck he had some so those are pretty neat I do have some picks with the newer handle let me grab those really quick so we can kind of compare them to the old style so you guys get a closer look so here's the uh, other set they call these the uh, Cornwall four piece seal and o-ring removal set and that's the new handles. And the part number on this guy is a CTG84ORS. Not a bad price. 42 bucks. Lifetime warranty. And these are the nice blue handles. And they do feel good. They kind of have like a gummy texture to them. But they're not too soft. Not too hard or not too soft. Perfect. And I, I haven't even used these yet. I grabbed them because he had them on his truck. And... There's not much on his truck with these blue handles. It's all green because he said the blue sells so fast and then it goes on back order. So I picked these up from him. Luckily, I saw him on there a few months ago. I don't know if I've shown you guys these or not, but um, I really like that. And then they have the big writing on there. Feels pretty good. Uh, I can't wait for my ratchet to come in. Might as well just tell you guys what I ordered. Uh, several months ago, I ordered the uh, 3H drive flex head ratchet from Cornwall with this handle. He has some on his truck with this handle, flex head 3H drive ratchet, longer one, like a 13 or a 12 inch. But all he has are the coarse tooth or 72 tooth, and they have the 120 tooth now. And it's been on back order for a while in green or blue, so I just went with blue because I want blue. And he said another guy has been waiting forever and every week he's like, sorry, hasn't came in yet. Still waiting for it. But 120 tooth Cornwell. Pretty excited to see how it compares like to the gear wrench 120. See how it feels. And uh, be pretty exciting to show you guys. I just, the Cornwall dealer has no idea when it's going to show up. But when it does, you guys will see it the day I get it. I'll post a video about it, and it will be on a Monday night, possibly a Tuesday when the video gets posted. So hopefully next week. I was hoping it would have been today, but it wasn't. So yeah, there's the new handle design versus the old handle design. About the same size, just no more square, uh, four-sided stuff. So yeah, I'm digging the new design. I like it. So, anyway, I hope you guys like this short little video. Um, I don't know if any of you guys have a Cornwall catalog, but um, I'm thinking in maybe one of my giveaways, uh, 
I'm going to, I think it'd be a good idea to send one of you guys, if, if I do a giveaway, a catalog from each tool truck. Because I know a lot of you don't have, don't get to go on every tool truck, or you don't have, probably have every catalog. Uh, I have every catalog for Cornwell, Mac, Matco, and Snap-on, so I think it'd be pretty cool to um, give away four catalogs and a tool obviously I'm not just gonna give away paper but once I hit a thousand subscribers I'll do that so we'll just do it I think this is the newest one I do have two more in my car um, yeah I have two more of these catalogs in my car but yeah they have everything man their USA line though I feel like is kinda diminishing they still have a lot of stuff. Look at those master pick sets. But this is the newer catalog. They make all their own punches and chisels. They're not Mayhew. My dealer told me that these are Ohio made. And I've yet to get my hands on some. Um, that would be a cool set to have. Uh, long taper drift punch set. That's cool. He has this set on his truck, but it's just a four-piece small set. I want something. Roll pin punch set. Yeah, they got a lot of cool stuff from Cornwell. It's one of those brands that a lot of people don't, haven't really experienced. And there's the ones I got. The 949s. Um, there's a different kind there. But yeah, they got, let me get to the USA sockets. Here's ratchets, just a quick little view. Quarter drive. You know what, I have the newer catalog in my car because the newer catalog has the new handled stuff. This is the older style stuff that you might still be able to get some of. 3H drive. Half inch drive. And they have like a super heavy duty ratchet that I've seen online. It was like their super, super duty half inch dry ratchet. Maybe it was the black one, I don't know. But yeah, half inch dry. Breaker bars, three quarter dry ratchets, they're black. One inch drive. And then here's their Ohio made sockets. Sorry if any of you guys are bored, but I think this is kind of cool to show you guys. They have their super sets. No, oh, Cornwell's good shit, man. Like, it's pricey, but, you know, the USA stuff on all the tool trucks is pricey. And I really do like their blue. They're bluing kind of finish on their black uh, impact sockets. Uh, CP talks about that, and it is, it is really nice and durable. Um, I don't know what the process is, but... And they come on these Vim magnetic rails now, which is really cool. I think it's cool that they did that. There's a quarter drive impact set, master. This is all the USA made stuff. Still quarter drive, a lot of options. 3H drive, probably a pretty pricey set. That set's probably freaking 500 bucks. Non slip go pass through socket set, that's cool. I want to eventually get some Cornwell sockets. Uh, a set of like impact sockets or something I have enough chrome sockets but there's a nice impact set universal sets deep shallow and I'll show you some of the half inch drive sets Man, they have a lot of sockets. I 
That'd be cool to get a set of these. Up to 24 and 3H drive on their wobbles. I don't think uh, all the brands do that. So that's something I didn't know. Look at that. You can get a set that goes all the way up to 22 deeps. I should get one of those to replace my gear wrench set. They're not the smoothest. I mean, this is nice stuff. I've seen some of it on his truck, but he doesn't stock a lot of it because it's been hard to get, I guess. Half inch drive, master set. Extra deeps. Those come really handy. Half inch drive wobble impact sockets. Head bolt socket sets. So yeah, three quarter drive stuff. I don't know if they have sets of the Ohio made. You might have to buy it all individually. So yeah, pretty cool. Check it out. Go on their website. Unfortunately, you can't buy online from them, but you have to have a dealer. So anyway, hope you guys like this video. Like, comment, share, subscribe. And have a good one. Thanks for watching.